Hey guys, this is Father Andre Melanson and I am the new Vocations Director for the Diocese of Homa Thibodeau. In my fourth year of being a priest, I uh, was ordained June 4th, 2011 and I uh, love being a priest. I spent two years at the Cathedral of St. Francis, my first assignment, and then last year the bishop assigned me uh, where I am recording right now at Nicholas State University here in Thibodeau as campus minister here. It's a beautiful assignment getting to walk with young people as they journey through this experience of college, helping them to discern God's presence in their life and just continue to fall in love with God every day through all the challenges of all college life. Really excited about this new adventure that God has called me into and in being vocations director for the Diocese of Homa Thibodeau. When I was discerning my call and trying to just ask the question, you know, what do you want from me, Lord? And as that stirring of priesthood started to rise up in my heart, I needed people to walk with me. I needed people to help me to know how to answer God's call and most particularly how to pray. Because it's only in prayer that we, we know the Lord's voice and we can really put a finger on Lord, what are you calling me to? And so it's a great joy and blessing that as I had great vocation directors that walked with me in my journey, that the Lord has invited me into that to walk with young men as they ask those questions in their life. What does a vocation director do? Well, our job is not to try to get as many priests as we can, you know, to try to recruit guys into the seminary, but really to walk with guys and to help guys to explore what the Lord is saying. So if you come to me and, um, and you say, you know, Father, you know, I think I'm thinking about being a priest, or Father, I'm just, I know that God's calling me to something more, I know that God wants something more, but I'm not sure what that is, then we walk and we journey together. It puts you in touch with all the other great priests in our diocese, the good seminarians, as we kind of journey together in this, seeking the Lord's will, seeking what the Lord wants. One of the great blessings in our diocese is that we have some, um, some great tools to help you discern. We have some awesome formation groups, Ignite Formation Group for high school students, and AMP Formation Group for our college students. And we're gonna be kicking off those groups real soon. And so like, if you're thinking about priesthood or you're just like, just, man, I just wanna live for, for the Lord. I don't know what that looks like, you know, I, I'm, I, would love to be a good husband if God's called me that. I'd love to be a good priest if God's called me to that. But like, I just know that I need to learn what it means to be a man, what it means to be a human person, what it means to fall in love, what it means to pray. What does it mean to live a radical discipleship for Jesus Christ? And that's what our formation groups do. It's getting together with good normal guys to come and to discern God's call and to journey together. So I'm excited about all the things that the Lord is going to have for us, the retreats and the formation groups and, and just journeying together. I'm excited about the young men that God has already called for our diocese who are in the seminary. I'm excited about the awesome young priests and old priests who are working in the trenches trying to lead souls to Jesus Christ. And man, I know that God's calling more people. I know that God is putting in the hearts of young men the desire to do something radical for their life, to live their lives and to lead people to Jesus Christ with their lives. And so let's continue to pray for one another. And if you have any questions or are you looking for something to help you to go deeper, just give us a call and we'll walk with you. God bless y'all.